Right, it's uh, Friday the 13th of September and uh, this is the start of a fishing match. It's 16 pairs, we're at Nipton Reservoir on a syndicate and uh, it is a match this weekend and we, my, me and my brother, we both decided to fish it as he's a member on here. As you can see it's a, quite a big old lake, it's 40 acres. I think there's 16 pairs, so there's quite a few on here. We chose, or well, pulled out the app, we pulled out this, uh, what they call the throne swim. And uh, it comes up to this, this dam, it down here. So it's the end of the lake. It's shallow up here. So we thought we'd blown out with the, with the swim cho uh, choice that we had. Um, as you can see it comes over this, there's a dam there, it's down. down into there. Runs into the canal, Grantham Canal. Anyway, so we thought we'd blown out, so anyway it was uh, sunny this afternoon and uh, we decided to have a look on this side of the bank, we're over there. You can just see the where the tree goes round. So we're, that's our swim over there and uh, luckily <laughs> there was uh, 10 to 20 fish up here all in the shallows. So we're quite hopeful actually of a, of a fish or two. Um, we've only just put the rods in, uh, it's about seven o'clock. We thought we'd let everybody else put the rods in uh, and then uh, let them crash and burn their swims if you like and hopefully push the push the fish out and hopefully up this way. So. Uh, yeah, hopefully. So hopefully we'll have a fish or two tonight. Uh, they're here, definitely here. So uh, yeah, it's open. So I'll keep you track if we have anything. Morning. It's quarter past eight in the morning, Saturday morning. We've just been on the radio and apparently there's been one out of 18 pound eight. We've had a quiet night, apart from getting bombed out by these trees. It's been raining all night. Go around and have a look. I'm going around that other bank in a minute, have a walk down there. See if I've got any fish in the swim. Been very quiet all night. So we'll see what happens. We're getting bombarded by this tree here. And it's dropping these big Nuggets all night. <laughs> Dropping them on top of the bivvy. Not sure what they are yet. It's much to do with acorns, but so if you stand about too long, you're going to get hit by one. <laughs> so we're just having a cup of coffee. And we're... Like I said, there's only one fish been out, so <laughs> early doors yet. We'll still rattle off. Camp. Hey, old mate. Morning. <laughs> and my old mate Simon, look. All How right, are you, mate? mate? All right. It's a good swim, this is. Boys are on it. Team yeah. Grand from Engineering. Whatever. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> oh, we see right down the lake from here, look. Nice view, what's about it? Yeah. It's half past nine and uh, we've seen nothing. I've had a walk round to the left towards the dam and uh, I've seen nothing. Um, you can see right across a whole bit of a lake that we've got and uh, the fish have moved out yesterday. Like I say there was about 10, 20 fish in there and they've moved out. Whether it's drop in temperature because of the rain we had last night or well what's pushed them out I don't know all the lines or the cars going up and down the back road there I'm not sure but uh, I think we're going to have to think about fishing maybe out towards there uh, open water a bit more maybe they moved into deeper water I'm not sure so it's a bit quiet at the minute just say a look in waiting 
for any sort of signs. Got one on the end of that that bush there. Um, had a liner off it last night. And that was it. I just I'm saying just sat here watching and just need one sign that I've got fish in the swim. Can't go any further <laughs> can't go any further up the lake than this. We've probably moved out into open water. I've been round I was round at Simon's and Midges there. They saw fish in front of them. But they were a long way out. So maybe they had moved out into open water into the middle of the lake and just held up. Who knows? Just gotta make the best of what we got really. So going along that back margin there's a got bags on the there's markers look. Got one up up there about two rod lengths out. Um, pretty clear after that, so we do get up that margin, apparently. We just have to wait and see, see what happens. We're all winding in at one one o'clock. Going around for a barbecue, bit of a social meeting. So, like I say it's still early, half eight, uh, half nine. Still got a chance of a bite. Keep the there. Where is it? Near the post. Far away. Anyway, we'll give it to one o'clock and then we'll wind in. Good for the social. And come back and uh, have a rethink. I might might put me in them one on that back edge edge over there. Towards that. There's a set of steps up there. Uh, there they are. I might want to put one towards there, along that back edge, and uh, maybe put one out into open water, try and find a weed patch or something. And it's just sit back and bloody out, really. Never mind. At least I'm fishing. I'm out of the way. <laughs> It's ten past six at uh, Saturday night. We've had the social and the barbecue. Uh, went really well. Got fed nicely. Thank you very much. Uh, so we just uh, had the afternoon. Uh, just watching the water. We've had no rods in. Just uh, just putting them in there. Uh, brother's round there. He's just gone round there to bait up. He's uh, put a marker out so he can get it bang on it. It's a massive big clear area yeah, you just see the I'll try and get on the right there you just see the marker there I think uh, yes yeah, um, good area there just had one crash to my right so we're putting the rods out for tonight I've got one towards uh, like I said earlier, towards them steps, towards them steps there, down there, about three quarters of the way across. Um, the weed's not too too deep there. So put a nice, nice little rig out there, and then I'm going to put one in an area that I found. Um, well, towards that, towards them vans, about halfway across. I found a nice little spot. I'm going to drop a rig on there for the night. And hopefully they'll come in. 
like they did yesterday. They moved out during the night and uh, oh, they're just not turned up. Uh, the brother baiting up. So we'll just see what happens tonight. Um, 21 pounds the biggest at the minute so that's winning the competition um, it's been an 18 pound out just round the corner from me off what they call the point and there's fish showing us something keeps topping over there I keep seeing it so so yeah 21 pound um, go out what they call the secret swim to a pair of lads so uh, yeah they're the winners at the minute it could all change tonight, who knows what's going to happen. 64 lines out, so it's a lot of lines in it in the water, so I think the fish will they'll back off a bit. So hopefully one or two of the lads and us will catch. And hopefully I'll have so much to to show you during the night if we can get it on video. Alright, speak to you later.